Hi, my name is Bertha Monoku and I'm one of the senior zoologists with the birds and ectotherms department. I usually take care of the wings of wonder birds as well as a few mammals, sloths and monkeys, and also our off-site facility, the Whooping Crane Center of Texas. So today we'll do a little bit of both. Come on with me. Welcome to the Whooping Crane Center of Texas. It was actually started in 2019. Currently we have 10 Whooping Crane adults and this is actually kind of away from people because we hope to breed and reintroduce the offspring into the wild population. Currently we actually have a chick with one of the pairs. This is a foster chick that was sent from the International Crane Foundation as an egg. It will be the first time we will be introducing a chick into the wild population. And so our whole team is very excited about it. Every day we have a keeper come out here to take care of these birds. And that includes feeding them, general husbandry, changing their water tubs, mowing, and that kind of thing. So we have to be quiet in the pens because even though the chick is a few pens away, we don't want it to get used to human sounds. But right now I just refilled their food buckets and I'm tossing a few pellets to them so that they can forage for themselves on habitats. This is the Whooping Cranes Command Center, as it were, and we do have camera footage at each of the pens so that we're able to observe the birds even if we're not in there with them and we can access these cameras remotely as well. So we are back at the Dallas Zoo and we are at Wings of Wonder. Every day we usually feed the animals, we take care of them, provide fresh water. A part of what we do is training. This is Bud's target stick, and so he is trained to touch the target and then we reward him. Bud just turned 42 on June 2nd. He's a very handsome boy, and he is the oldest bird that we have on Wings of Wonder. Target. Good. Target. Good. Targeting is the first step in training, and so once he learns how to target, we'll move from that to A to Bs, to move him from one place to another, target. and eventually the end goal will be to bring him inside to shift. Good. This is one of our female sloths. Her name is Baby Ruth, and she is five years old, and sloths are typically nocturnal, and so we usually feed them most of their diet in the p.m. and just a little bit during the day. Hello everyone, welcome to my Keeper Chat. My name is Bertha. The Wings of Wonder usually has a Keeper Chat every day at 1.30. It's a really nice opportunity for us to talk to the public about all the different species that we have here on grounds, their conservation status, and also many people are curious about their husbandry and how to take care of them and have really like to hear fun facts about them. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed spending a day in the life of a bird zoologist. And the next time you're here at the Dallas Zoo, please swing by Wings of Wonder and I hope to see you there. Bye.